The Bible doesn't tell us how long the layman in Acts chapter 3 had sat begging at the temple gate, but it was a daily occurrence. When he saw Peter and John, the odds are he wasn't expecting anything. Just another day trying to survive. Then Peter said, Silver and gold I do not have, but what I do have I give you. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, rise up and walk. There's an important lesson here for us. God has set times for doing certain things. He has a calendar and our names are on it. Sometimes we can miss our set time and forfeit what God has for us. That means we must learn to live in expectation because God's blessings are either coming towards us or passing us by. Miracles happen to those who believe in them, ask for them, expect them and receive them. The enemy will try to keep us so preoccupied, cynical and hopeless that when God sends the answers we prayed for, we won't recognize it. We won't reach for it or we won't receive it. Waiting for change. January 2020. We were waiting for change. Brexit was here. We were waiting to see what the results would be. We were waiting to see the resolutions that would be made. We were waiting. We were waiting for change. March 2020. The pandemic came. We were waiting again. We were waiting with restrictions because there was the lockdown. We were waiting with worries in our minds. We were waiting nervously. We were waiting anxiously. But we were waiting. We were waiting for change. It wasn't until a friend said, why worry? Why be nervous? Why be anxious? God has this. He has a calendar and our names are on it. We would be waiting for change, but God would be making that change for us. We're waiting on Christmas, but once again, we are waiting with restrictions. This Christmas is going to be different. This Christmas, we're waiting to see how can we celebrate? What can we do to celebrate? But we do know that we will celebrate. We will celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ. We would wait prayerfully. We would wait hopefully. We would wait with anticipation. Were you waiting on the election results from the US? I know I was waiting. I waited and I waited. I waited long hours. I waited days. I waited nights. I waited to see if there would be change. But I waited. Sometimes in life, our blessings come early. Sometimes they come later. But they always come and they're always on time. Keep praying. Have faith. Ask, believe and wait because miracles do happen.